So Google Ads not loading in your website can be really frustrating and your ad revenue goes down. So normally it happens when you install a speed optimization plugin, for example, Lightspeed Cache plugin. You can see this is my website. I can see the ads on my website because I'm logged inside. But if I see my website in private browsing mode, you can see this is my website and I do not have ads loading on my website. So I'm not getting any ad revenue. So let me show you how you can fix this issue and you have the ads loading properly on your website so you can start earning your revenue back again. In this video, I will give you an example of Lightspeed Cache plugin, but you can apply the same logic to any other speed optimization plugin, no matter what plugin you use, and then you will be able to load your ads properly using any speed optimization plugin. Before I give you the quick solution, I would like to show you like why you are having this error and why these speed optimization plugins break the Google ads. Because guys, in this channel, I would really like to give you some knowledge and I want you to learn something. So that is all purpose. I will not take very long. It will be like very fast explanation about this technical stuff that why ads are breaking and how we can fix them. And guys, one last thing. We are very close to reach 10,000 subscribers. So thank you everyone who is already subscribed. And if you're new to the channel, please don't forget to subscribe to the channel and like this video. Because I create this so many amazing videos which you'll not find anywhere else on YouTube. I create video about website development, speed optimization, blogging, chat GPT, and so many interesting topics. So guys, make sure you subscribe to the channel. I would really appreciate that and that will really make me happy. And I will know that you are learning something new and you are improving your web skills. So you can see here when you log in into your AdSense account, you can see the script which you add on your website to display ads. And you can see here we have the async tag. So this script is already very much optimized for speed optimization. It will not block your website loading because the async tag is added in the script and it is given by the Google directly. So what happens? This is my website and I use Lightspeed Cache plugin. But if I see the source code, you can also do that. Right click on your page screen and then click on view page source. And if I search here, ads by Google, you can see we have this script here. So you can see we have this script here, script, SRC and the Google script. And then after, we have this cross origin anonymous, that's fine. But here we have this tag added defer and data deferred equal to one. And we do not have async tag here. You can see there's no async tag. You can just compare by yourself here in Google AdSense, you have async tag and here you do not have async tag. So what is happening here? Our speed optimization plugin is optimizing the script, which we do not need. And that is causing ads not loading on our website. I hope you understand like why you are seeing this error. So let me show you the quick fix how you can fix this issue. I hope I did not took so much time and you learned something technical. So in Lightspeed Cache plugin, go to option page optimization and you can apply the same logic to any speed optimization plugin. What you need to do is you need to find option tuning or it can be some other option. But what you really need to find is JS excludes. So what we will do here, we will tell Lightspeed Cache plugin or you are using any other plugin that do not optimize our ad script, it is already optimized by Google. So what I will do, I will just add this name here, ads by google.js. So this script is responsible on our website to display ads. And I will add it JS excludes and also I will add it here, JS deferred and delayed excludes. And then if you are using guest mode, it is safe to add the script here too. In case of Lightspeed Cache plugin. In case of other plugins, where you find an option to exclude the JavaScript file, add this. Normal Lightspeed Cache plugin is very advanced plugin, so you need to add three times. But if you're using WP Rocket, WC Total Cache, WP Fastest Cache, WP Super Cache, you can add this script where it says JS exclude and then click on save changes. And guys, make sure to clear the cache of your website. You can see in Lightspeed Cache plugin, if I hover here and then I click on purge all. And there is one more important and interesting thing. You'll see this option purge all Cloudflare. Because what happens sometimes when you use Cloudflare on your website and you're not connected Lightspeed Cache plugin with Cloudflare. So when you clear the cache, your Lightspeed Cache got clear, but you still have cache on Cloudflare. I create a detailed video how you can add Cloudflare with Lightspeed Cache plugin. So check the description of this video. So when I click on Purge All, all the cache will be cleared. And now if I reload this page and I search again, ads by Google, you can see our async tag is back and we have the complete script here. We do not have any more optimization from the speed optimization plugin. So this will solve your issue. If this didn't solve your issue, check these two other videos on screen by which you can do troubleshooting and fix any issue on your website if it happens because of a speed optimization plugin like Lightspeed Cache. Don't forget to like, sub and share the channel. I will really appreciate that.